Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's round one, over and done with, and we've got Ghost Rider and a Refresh Rampage, which I believe is a repeat of one they have done previously. Okay, and I forget all that it has, but I think it has Ant-Man, um, it has Storm in it. Uh, basically, all the champions I already have. All right, and check this out. I've already done the Catalyst Clash, right? And we're on the Sunday ones. But there's an Arena Wins event. And you know I got to get those units. I just spent almost all my units. Um, I still got a ton in uh, Battle Chips, but I spent a lot of units already, so I need to make sure I get all my units. So that means that I'm probably going to end up grinding in this uh, Crystal Trove here because I can use my six stars and get uh, get the uh, milestone I need to get the uh, units out of that Arena Wins uh, event. All right, let's take a look at the uh, leaderboards here. Now, let's see, Ant-Man, Juggernaut, Storm, and uh, Deadpool X-Force. That's who we got in there. Okay. Now, uh, I believe this one was the basic. Yeah. So good luck to those of you who have gotten the champion that you want. Uh, leave a comment because there are people that want to know uh, roughly what the cutoff was so they could try to get one of the champions in here for round two. Uh, whale milker. <laughs> now, I'll tell you, if I had not pulled that juggernaut recently i would have definitely been grinding here for that juggernaut but thankfully i got him from a, a <laughs> penny hung uh, i got him from a crystal so i did not need to grind for him uh this arena now the only six star that i'm actually hunting for now is Aegon. If they put Aegon in the basic or in the in the featured, doesn't matter where they put him. He come to the arena, I'm grinding for him. Unless I pull him from a crystal before then. That's what happened with Juggernaut. Let's see if that happens with him. But we'll see. They don't want to give me um, Aegon. All right. Uh, let's see. These guys in here are probably not the most desirable. I think the most in here is that juggernaut. So I'm not expecting to see a lot of uh, names that I recognize because these champions are pretty old. But like juggernaut, I didn't have a juggernaut. And it's been a long time since six stars came out. And I didn't have one. <laughs> Charlie's dad. I remember you. Gabriel, congratulations. Dread Hazard. All right. Hitman. Destructor. There's Laser John. Congratulations. I don't know who he... Let me see. If he said who he was going for here. I'm actually not sure. Uh, no. Yeah, I don't. I don't see where he. Um, nope, he hasn't mentioned it yet. I mean, it just you know came in, so it might take a little bit. Um, he may be doing something else, but probably juggernaut. If he doesn't have one, anybody that doesn't have a juggernaut and is grinding in here, I'm pretty sure that's who they're going for. But he may be a collector like me. And I used to go for any champion that I didn't have. And I kind of still do that, especially when it's in the basic. Juan Jose. Ghetto J. That name sounds familiar. Congratulations, man. Dirty bird. <laughs> Have you heard? 
a brand new dance called the bird. Oh, man. Times change. All right. Gray Fox. All right. So that's the basic. I don't know what the cutoff is, but I'm pretty sure it's not going to be really high. I think my guesstimate was around 20 mil, which is probably a little high. But for round one, if I were going for this, you already know and you've seen me before. I put up like 30 and 40 mil. Way overkill, but I get the champ. All right, and here we have Ghost Rider. Now, this is the featured, and I have a feeling that most of the people you see here, those top three, were going for the Warbound title. They're trying to get that number one spot many times because especially now that Kushala is in the game, people aren't even bothering with poor OG Ghost Rider. Not to mention, most people already have him. I have him. And I remember back in the day, he saved me so many items in Alliance Quest. I could heal up with him. Beautiful. Like even now, uh, Saitama, congratulations, man. Uh, even now, when I go into uh, Alliance Quest, I don't have anybody uh, that can heal. So I have gone in with some people that are very hard to kill. Okay, I got Nick Fury. I got Hercules. And um, Null. Now, Null can heal. He's the only one that can heal a little bit. Um, if you get his, you know, rotation right after you do the special one, you know, um, he's the only one that can actually heal a little bit, not like Ghost, um, Ghost Rider. So uh, in that path that I take in a Alliance Quest, on that path I take in Alliance Quest, um, I tend to use Hercules and then Nick Fury so that in Section 2... I'll have um, my null because, and this has happened before. Um, null, I go in there and I'm fighting and then something happens. Shenanigans, maybe I'm too sleepy, you know, whatever. I mess up, okay? What ends up happening there, a uh, little chilling, I see you. Uh, what happens there is he can die from a, a single... Um, a uh, 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 rotation, one combo, or I get hit with this combo and I'm low. Arknephilim. And once I'm low like that, see, it's not like, um, it's not as good as Ghost Riders, which is why I sometimes forget that Null can heal because he doesn't heal like Ghost Rider. Not only that, but Ghost Rider kind of needs Blade with him, in my opinion. He has a chance to fail without Blade. With Blade, no chance to fail. And that is who I brought in. I brought in um, an AQ, Blade, Ghost Rider, Spider-Man Stark Enhanced. They were considered that um, Trinity. And it was a very good Trinity, too. Because each one of them is good. And each one of them made the other ones better. It was a beautiful, beautiful uh, synergy with those three. Still is. So I can understand if somebody doesn't have Ghost Rider. And I can imagine, because I haven't used Ghost Rider in a long time, and I just pulled Blade. So I might, just for nostalgia, bring Blade in. Um, because I'm pretty sure Blade can do uh, my path as well. So I might. Thinking about it now, I might bring Blade and uh, Ghost Rider in there. No, Ghost Rider won't work. Blade will, but Ghost Rider won't. I think Ghost Rider, I can put one debuff on them, but you need three 
in order to do uh, any damage. So Blade, yeah. But I think I'll stick with um, Nick Fury. He works great. And of course, Null works awesome. Uh, Gabriel, double dipping. I see. Yayama. I like how that rolls off. Yayama. Rad Megs. Is that supposed to be Red Mags? In a little trans uh, position kind of a way? Let's see. Who? Sexiness. Oh, okay. There's that Plebiceratops. Plebiceratops. <laughs> I don't know why that one makes me smile. All right. Getting down to the end here. And we are done. All right, so that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. Definitely leave your score and your rank because that helps out people who come by to try and see if uh, they can find out the cutoff or get a rough idea of what they're going to need to put up. All right, so take care, and you all have a blessed day.